user accounts and enrolling users in courses can be very time consuming for an administrator. So it's good to know there is a process that will save an infinite amount of time. So logged in as the administrator, on the front page we go to the settings block, site administration, users, accounts, upload users. Before we go any further, we would first need to prepare a CSV file, either in a spreadsheet program or a text editing program. Um, CSV is all about uh, comma separated values. That's the format of the file. Um, the first row of this file contains the, the fields and then the subsequent rows, each row contains a unique user record. So in this case, uh, in the first row, we've got username, password, first name, last name, email. Each of those fields are mandatory. And then the subsequent fields are optional. There's in fact a lot of other fields we could also add um, to this file and it's well documented. However, the syntax and the convention needs to be spot on or this process won't work. Course 1 and Type 1 correlate as do Course 2 and Type 2. So uh, the course is in fact the, uh, it needs to be the short name of the course and the type uh, is a value uh, that relates to the role. Uh, the value of one is the default course role, um, which is student. The value of two is editing teacher. The value of three is non-editing teacher, just by way of example. So then we can see in this, uh, in this file the second and the third row uh, user records that correspond to the, uh, the fields or values contained in the first row of this file. So this is saved in CSV format. We would then uh, return to this page and choose to upload that file. Uh, the upload type uh, can uh, be performed in various ways. So typically we will add new users um, and skip existing. However, uh, we might in fact want to uh, add all and append numbers to usernames if required, add new and update existing users, or update existing only. So we've got options that we uh, can determine here. Upload users. This uh, pre-processes the records in the CSV file and gives us some indication of um, how the upload, how the upload uh, will proceed, and it's recommended that you uh, that you create a, a small test file with perhaps a, a couple dummy users in it before you commit this process to many hundreds of thousands of users. We've got some some settings uh, that can be determined here, including some default values uh, that can be. Uh, can be adjusted for all users in the said file. Upload users. So there we have it. Two, news, two new user accounts were created and uh, those users were enrolled uh, in the said courses uh, with, with uh, the intended roles. It uh, might also uh, be worth mentioning that uh, uh, the password uh, with a value of change me uh, will force um, a password change upon first login. Uh, 